Hello guys and gals, it's Rybro bringing you vlog number three. Uh, this is going to be a two week sobriety update on how my sober darts are going. Um, sobriety itself, piece of cake. I mean, I have some cravings. I drink NA beer here and there when I feel like I want a beer. So I'll have an NA, but honestly, hasn't bothered me. Um, the darts side. I had a really good stream last night. I mean, I'm back up to like a 3-3. I was a 4-1 or so. when A 4-1 before I went sober. Dropped it down to a 2-3. Now I'm back up a whole mark. I'm up to a 3-3. Um, I had a really good stream. I loosened up last night. I had fun. I was looking forward to streaming. Yeah. Um... I didn't think in two weeks that seeing like the light at the end of the tunnel, that moment would, would happen this quick, but I'm seeing it. It's going to pay off. Um, I know I can do it. So I'm, I'm really, really looking forward to the upcoming streams. I'm really looking forward to the upcoming months. Um, don't get me wrong. I'm at maybe 40% of what I was before I quit drinking, but um, it's going up. And, yeah, something I never thought was possible. So, I, I have run into a few problems. And I know I've mentioned it on stream. Uh, my hands are cold. My hands get really cold. Usually a few beers warms them up, but I, I'm not doing that. So, I don't really want to go out and buy a bunch of hand warmers. But, usually they warm up after about... You know, I'll warm up, I'll play for about an hour and a half before the stream, but at the same time, I'm also like, not, I'm like getting the stream set up and making, and testing it, making sure everything works. So I'm, you know, it's not like a full hour and a half warm up, you know, maybe it's more like 45 minutes. My hands are still cold when I go into the stream, and I'd say it's probably at least another half hour into the stream before my hands start to warm up, but that's an issue I'm running into. And if I quit throwing for a little bit, my hands get cold again. So that's a new issue for me that I'm, I've never dealt with before. The other one I'm having is back in December, I developed my release changed a little bit. And it's, I don't know, it's making the dart come out where the tail dips backwards and the tip is pointed. I mean, it's almost straight up and down like this. It's like if this is the tip, it's like this. It, comes out of my hand like that and then on its way to the board it starts to level out and then it's kind of corkscrewing and it it was really bad at state but sober about an hour in when my arm starts to get a little bit tired it's really bad so something else uh, that's kind of come out of it on the negative side that I've got to work on and try to fix um, but I'll get it. I'm not too concerned with it. Right now I'm just concerned with being able to throw sober. So <sighs> otherwise it's possible. So, you know, anybody else that attempts it that wants to quit drinking when they play darts, try it. Get through that first week. Play every single day that first week and try it. And I promise you after that first week you will you'll start to see it you'll start to realize that it is absolutely possible i didn't think it was but it is so other than that i have nothing else so um looking forward to future streams um they should be better and better and better my level of play should should continue to get better and better um other than that guys uh, as always i appreciate everybody that tunes in and watches every single one of my streams and likes and shares it and uh We'll see you guys on Tuesday. Have a good Sunday.